Good morning, folks. Happy Saturday. It is, I don't know, May 18th, and we're about to go fishing. Um, this will be my first saltwater trip of the year. Uh, usually a bit earlier than I start, but I've got the kayak and got the weekend, so why not, right? Um, we're going to give a shot at fishing in uh, Jamaica Bay, Rockaway Inlet area. Never fished there before. So this is going to be experience for me. Uh, I'm really hoping that I can get into some fluke perhaps, but I've heard there's some stripers and blues around. So really at this point, I'll take anything. But uh, with a little luck, maybe we'll get some fishing accomplished. See you there. And I'm about to shove off and uh, looks like we got here just in time because traffic is starting to back up uh, on the belt. So. Hoping that uh, that's not the case with leave, because that's the only way out, but you know what? That's future dance problems. Solution, get some fishing accomplished. We are off. Here we are making our wood. A little breezy, but nothing we can't handle. A little pedal drive. These really are exciting times, folks. Could have went freshwater fishing. Would have been a sure thing probably, but what's the fun in that? Tomorrow's supposed to, the wind's supposed to howl. So, figured this is really my only shot to saltwater fish for some time. I not work all week, so I might as well give it a shot today. What's the worst that can happen? It should become a kayak session, no fish. I'm okay with that. Okay, we are shoving off in the Rockaway Inlet. Really hoping to find some fish. First saltwater experience of 2019. Living the dream. So first thing we gotta do, of course, get the Mirage Drive in the water. Secure the leash, God forbid, something happens. Got a couple things leached. Make sure we're in good. Sometimes it requires a little bit of finesse. Got to put down the rudder. And baby, we are good to go. So, I don't know this area at all. Uh, before I do any fluking of any kind, I'm going to not use this rod. I am going to troll. Let's see if we can stir up some kind of predators. Wish me luck. Fishing a bit deeper now. Uh, found a 30 foot ledge right here, so we're gonna see if we find any flukes stacked up in this. Got a little bit of a rip developed right here too. Definitely getting a bit of a drift, so Let's see if we got anything holding over here. Fluke or otherwise. Definitely boats out here, so that's a good sign. I'm not the only one giving it the old early spring go. Fish on. Hell yeah. What do we got? Probably a sea robin. No, we got a bluefish. All right. First saltwater fish of the year right there. Now let's not get our fingers lopped off. And quick release. I'll take it. I will take it. All right. Wasn't all waste. <laughs> so at least we've gotten one hook up today. That's promising. Oh, fish on. What do we got? Feels a little bit more solid. Probably another bluefish. Get the net just in case. Now we got a fluke. Oh, we got a fluky. It's official. We got what we came for. Look at that. 
rip over here. So we're gonna try and stay next to this because maybe uh something bigger is holding it in here. About 30 feet of water. I'm trying to hold this. Maybe there's some big bait trapped in there. And where there's big bait, there's big fish. At least that's the hope. Got just a perfect drift right now. And that's so important. So you wanna keep moving, but not too fast. So the fish have a chance to look at it and get it, but you don't want it to be too slow that you're not covering any ground. So this is ideal. I'm holding bottom perfectly. Good depth. Now we just need to find the right fish. But you know what? I'll settle for any more fish. Let's not get too cocky now. There's a fish. That's a fluke. That's better. Don't think he's gonna make it, but why not? Not gonna do it, but it's a good sign. Getting bigger. There we go. That feels better. Got a little more weight behind that fish. That might be a better sized fish. Oh yeah. And no, they'll still net it. Don't wanna snap them. This is awesome. I fish for days. All right, we're retrying this drift again since it seemed like we fell off the fish. So back we are. There's a the fish. Feels all right. What do we got? Yep. Still not a keeper, but we're getting in the right size. We're getting some fish. Got a nice pattern going. Another 17 incher. Back you go. He ain't gonna keep, but still fun. That feels a bit better. That might be something substantial-ish. It's pulling. Oh yeah. Let's get that net ready. Oh yeah, that's a keeper. That will be the first keeper of 2019 if we can land her.
Yes, booyah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that net, as you're probably noticing, is a little small. Uh, I have a much better net, but unfortunately it's at my, I left it at my parents' house. So right now I have to make do with this little trout net that I had from the winter. Uh, you'll notice too. as these videos go on, I'll have a better net in the future. Lucky me. So at this point in the video, you'll notice that quite a bit of time has gone by since the last part. Uh, probably a good hour or two. Uh, did manage a few fish here and there, but it really just died the bite. Probably because the wind died and the tide started to shift. So all I was really getting was little tiny fish. But right at about this point, I found quite a few fish and they were all concentrated right together. So check this out. There we go. That feels heavier. That's definitely bigger than the last couple. What do we got? Feels decent. Is it the target species? Got some weight behind this fish. Oh yeah, oh yeah, come on, come on, come on, turn around, turn around, come on, yes. that's two, <laughs> yes. Keeper of the year, <laughs> yes. Two. There we go. That's a heavy fish. That feels very nice. No! Oh my god, that felt good. Dang it. Come on, come back. Same fish. Feels good. Feels really good. That's a good fish. That might be the fish to end on right there. Oh boy. Oh boy. Give this fish plenty of time. Plenty of time for this fish. Oh, he's hooked weird. He's not that big. Never mind. He wasn't that big. Well, whatever, more fishing. Had me going for a second though. Thought I had him.
coming up on a tidal shift right here. See if there's anything sitting right on the periphery of this. Ooh, baby. We're on a good bite right now. It feels like a good fish. It's not hooked like the last one. Nice fish though, that's a keeper. All right, so uh, yeah, we're gonna call it right now. I'm just gonna troll my way back in, see if maybe I can hook something up on this little swim shad. But that being said, uh, first day back at it in salt water was, all things said, pretty good. Uh, got two keep, well, three keepers technically. Uh, kept two of them hot and cold bite but what can you really ask for this time of year it's mid-may so all in all i'm very happy with how things went and uh i'm just hoping that this is just a sign of things to come and we get some really quality fish this year but i definitely look forward to coming back here and i hope that this is the start of a great 2019 fish season in saltwater that'll do it and see y'all around